Hey guys, what's happening? It's Lowell Rampel. I just wanted to show you something really cool today. Now, if you guys sell physical products uh, on a Shopify or WooCommerce or on Amazon or eBay or any other platform, I've got something really, really cool that you'll want to see. Check this out. So I've built software that basically extrapolates any kind of information you need very, very quickly. All right, so let's just jump right into it. I'm on amazon.com. I'm just gonna type in some random things here, but let's put in party supplies. All right, okay. So once you have any kind of items that you've searched for in Amazon, you can go to our Chrome extension called the AS Inspector. You click on this, it'll automatically populate everything that's on that page, but it brings you all sorts of data that you're looking for. So it's gonna pull up the product name and full description. Uh, you can hover your mouse over just so you know exactly which, which product you're looking at. It'll tell you the brand, category, uh, the, what ranking it's at, the estimated sales in amount, as well as volume in dollars per month, the number of reviews, rating, uh, if, if they're an FBA seller, Amazon, you know, so much data here. But uh, let's just go into some of these just so I can explain each one of these. So first off, the product name, uh, if, if it's too long, it'll be shortened. But if you click this little information button, it will actually expand it for you. Brand, not too concerned about that. But uh, for category, this is really cool. So if you want to know, you know, parent-child relationships, what nodes it's currently listed in and stuff like that, which is really important when you're deciding what categories someone else is, is ranking in, um, you can easily see that just by hovering your, your mouse over it. Or if you, again, want to just click that little information button, uh, you can copy and paste these or do whatever you want with it. So as you can see, this is a very, very useful tool already, but it gets way better. So um, it'll tell you your ranking, the estimated sales. These are all per month in the currency of the platform that you're on. So if you're on .com, it's going to give you everything in US dollars, .ca, Canadian, .co, .uk, in euros, and every other platform that you go on for Amazon. How we came up with this estimated monthly revenue, it is a very complex calculation. So some have asked me, how did we come up with this calculation? So first off, it's a really complex calculation on how we came up with these numbers. But what we're also doing is we're comparing it to real results of things that we're currently selling and some others. And we're constantly adjusting those with that algorithm. And with your AS Inspector, it's constantly being updated all the time. So you don't have to like re-download it or anything. It just auto updates all the time. So this is gonna be a very, very accurate number. So this is a really cool tool when you're seeing, you know, uh, how much you need to give away or sell for a, a really good price to beat your next best competitor or just, just to see if you even wanna dabble in that space, if it's even worthwhile to bring in a product or sell it, whether it's on, you know, one of your e-com stores or doing it on, you know, eBay or Amazon or whatever platform that you sell things on. So. That's a couple of things, but let's let's just jump into some other stuff. So let's just grab one of these. Let's see, the Martha Stewart. All right, let's do this. Uh, let's let's use this one. All right, so pom poms. If you guys ever wanted some Martha Stewart pom poms, uh, maybe you want to play in the space. Maybe you do play in the space. So sorry if this is one of your products, but um, you can quickly search it on Alibaba.com. You just click on that, and instantly it's going to populate if if that product is available on Alibaba.com. Um, you can also do AliExpress, same sort of thing. It just automatically populates that all for you. So you can really quickly see, you know, what, what kind of cost you can get this for uh, to see if you even want to play in that. You can also see if it's on a platform like eBay, right? You can see, wow, like Martha Stewart is selling everywhere with these pink pom-poms, right? You can see if it's on Walmart. I'll just wait till this populates. All right, and we got, again, you can see what kind of pricing is all those now you can also do some other cool stuff you can uh, you can compare with other competitors so it'll actually pull up all of the pricing that would be on amazon ebay walmart right so it's a it's a really cool tool that way and you can also calculate if you if you have a cost if you even want to play around with selling it so say you got it for 10 cents and if uh and, and what this calculator does is it's seeing if you had Amazon fulfilling all the orders and you're paying all the Amazon fees, if it's even worth it. And sometimes we can see that it's not even worth it or it is worth it um, 
based on uh, based on this calculator. So this one, for example, if you got this for 10 cents, I, you know, you could have some some pretty insane ROI on that, right? But you know, if it's uh, say 80 cents, you can see that wow, that's that's maybe not so not so good and maybe not worthwhile bringing it in or a dollar or whatever. So um, it's a really really cool tool just to just to see you know all sorts of data instantly. Now what's also really, really cool about this tool, if you go into the bottom right here and you click on this little option button, you can actually set this up exactly how you want it. So if you want to show like the ASIN number all the time or parent ASIN or whatever, whatever you select on here, it'll save it and you'll always have it saved that way of how you last set it up. So you can see all sorts of data that you can pull. You can you can pull everything here. So let's just use an example here. Let's just do package dimensions, all right? So we're just gonna click yes on this and you'll see that it instantly see the package dimensions, what you want to, and any other data that you wanna pull off this. So it's really cool how this works. Um, you can also, what, whatever you've decided and whatever kind of data that you've pulled, you can instantly download this in an Excel format, a CSV, you know, and uh, and save that data. So you can have lots of windows open all the time. So let's jump into some other examples just to show you how easy this really is. Let's jump back over to Amazon. Let's put in, let's put in tents. Spell right. All right, so we got tents here again. Um, as soon as this populates, you can quickly go to Yes, I can, inspector. It'll pull up a new window, which is really cool because you can be searching for a whole bunch of things at once and it just keeps all of these tabs open. So it's really easy to use that way. So I'm actually gonna turn off this package dimensions again, just so, just so it comes. That's just the way I like it set up, but let's just explore this. Let's just pretend that uh, this, this Coleman tent we got for, I don't know, $10. Or let's see what, what's, let's see what it's selling it for at other places. All right, I'm just gonna plug to Walmart. So we got 47, So normally you'd have to go through each one of these, but I'll show you an even faster way of doing this. You can just go to this little compare and it'll pull all the data right away and see that the average price on eBay, 63 bucks, 41 Amazon, 47 Walmart. So um, you can always, always see too, instead of just trying to be the best price, let's try to get the most margin. I mean, we're trying to make money online, right? So let's sell items for the right price. I mean, it's it's okay to charge extra money, right? I mean, it's a it's a really good deal for the end user anyways. So so let's say that you got this tent for 12 bucks. Let's just say that we compared it to this particular one. You can see right away again, wow, you know what? It's a decent ROI. You know, as long as your shipping and stuff makes sense, you can pull us this tent in and you already know the volume that it's doing per month. So even if you played with a little piece of that, I know this is a brand, but I'm just using this as an example. Um, you can quickly get data to see if it's even worthwhile. Now what's cool too is, as you can see, it'll only pull the data that's on the current page for Amazon. So we've got 26 results. But if you click on this little plus sign down here, it'll actually add and load the products from the next page of Amazon. So you don't have to like keep opening up new pages. So now you can see that there's all sorts of results on here, right? And it'll populate real quickly. So again, it's just a really, really cool way of searching for products. So. A lot of people are gonna love this, especially people that are selling in other countries, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you a couple other examples. So let's just say that we went to Amazon, spell great, .co.uk. So let's play in the UK for a second. So let's just say that we are doing a guitar, searching for a guitar. Right now you don't have to change anything. You can just click on the AS inspector, automatically it's gonna pull everything in euros, which is really cool. It's automatically going to whatever platform you're on, whether it's, well here, let's do some other ones. So we're on Amazon, let's do .ca. All right. All right, so we're jumping over to Canada here real quick. Let's just go Bluetooth speaker. All right, so again, let's pull this up, All right? Just take a couple seconds here, it'll automatically populate again. You can see how much volume in Canadian dollars now this particular product is selling, right? So, I mean, if you found, if, if you wanna play in this space and you can get something even even in the top 10 here, I mean, oh, you can sort them too. So if you wanna, 
go just by the lowest revenue or the most revenue, you can see that you know even if you got in the top uh, 10 or 15 or whatever, there's still a lot of volume here to play with. So um, you can search it really quick as, as I showed you earlier. So you can quickly get your pricing here down, even if you're doing a Shopify or WooCommerce or your own e-com platform. I mean, this is a really, really cool way to research super fast. Our team is finding that this is going like 10 to 15 times quicker. So it saves you a ton of time and you can export your data really quick. So really easy how that works. Uh, it'll also do some cool things here too that you can, uh, if you have a whole bunch of tabs open and you forget you know, what was I just searching for to get exactly this? Well, you know what? Just click the link of the page and boom, it'll just pull it up and and that's how you came in on it, right? The Bluetooth speaker. I know this is a simple example, but when you have sometimes 50 tabs open, really easy to pull that data up, right? It'll also do some other cool stuff where you can, you can get the search of the keywords that you just searched for and, uh, and lots of other things. So anyways, very, very cool on how fast you can export data. And what else is really, really cool is that we're, we're just constantly, constantly updating this. So everything that we're adding, we've even added a couple of things, you know, over the last three or four days that we've been beta testing before we added it to it and everyone really liked it. So we decided to add a couple more things. And again, it's just, it's just that much better and it's gonna auto update on your tool. So this is really, really cool what you can do. And you can, again, save everything that you want the way that you want it. So very, very cool how this tool works. It's gonna save you a ton of time. It's gonna make you a lot of cash because everything that you're searching for to see if it's even worthwhile, you can you can find out the, the data right away of how much sales dollars that they're currently doing, if it's even worthwhile, if you can get it, if you, you know, cost-wise, if it's even worthwhile sourcing that out, you can find that all out in seconds. So it's really, really cool how this tool works. Here's the thing, I've been asked by so many people that have been playing around with this, well, you need to sell this product. And I'm, you know, we were hesitant because it's something that we use, it's something that is a very, very valuable tool for us. So, you know, we, we sort of weighed it out and, uh, you know, we're coming up with like a, a yearly license fee and all that kind of stuff. But this is, this is what I'm gonna do. So, if you were invited to come and see this and someone's asked you to see, see this via a list or an email or however you were invited to be here, you can feel pretty special because we are gonna do something today that is incredible. So we are actually gonna do a lifetime license on this product for 67 bucks. 67 bucks, so you, can't, you, you seriously can't go wrong. It's a lifetime, automatically updates. It's very, very cool how it works. And we also even have a private Facebook group where you can you know, post maybe ideas of what we could add to the tool and if we feel it's a valuable thing, we'll do it because we're using this tool as well. It's really, really important. And also, if you have questions, there's a lot of other people that'll be selling physical products and you know, on platforms like Amazon and eBay and whatever that can answer your questions. And I mean, it's just great minds all together in one private Facebook group. Also, if you're not happy with it for whatever reason, there is a full 30 day money back guarantee. Guys, you can't go wrong. This is a very, very private thing that we're doing right now before we launch it, before we go up to the, the price that we're thinking of 197 per year and 97 every year after, you're getting a lifetime license, 67 bucks. Can't go wrong. Make sure to grab yours today before this deal is over. I'm Lowell Rample, this is the AS Inspector. Have a fantastic day and we'll see you on the inside.